My name is Maria Best. I'm a design and lifestyle blogger. I'm also an interior design consultant based in Montreal. As someone who's very uh, visual and who likes the instant gratification that comes from just using your hands to transform something, interior design uh, is something that fulfills me tremendously. HomeSense gave me a great challenge. They asked me to design and style two different vignettes that would showcase one item. Copper, copper accessories, copper pots. So I had to come up with two different vignettes, style them, and make sure that they had original and very distinct looks. The first is a really uh, modern industrial butler's pantry, kind of a modern take on a Downton Abbey butler's pantry. And the second is much warmer, much softer, a kind of farmhouse breakfast nook. What I love about shopping at HomeSense is that they carry a variety of styles. So I can get something really modern and in the same visit find something very traditional. An industrial modern look is all about mixing textures. For the butler's pantry, I wanted some beautiful rustic old barn wood and contrasting it with some dark, rough metal. Obviously in this space, the hero is all the copper, especially against that deep, beautiful, inky colored wall, just shines and it's spectacular. Another reason I love the copper is that it's really affordable. I'm talking, it's starting at $50, which is pretty incredible. We also brought in this beautiful mirror to put against the wall. Small spaces always benefit from having a reflective surface in there, and this mirror almost looks like a submarine porthole. So let's start layering in the pieces, and we'll just try and create a balance between all the copper and the white. We brought in some dishware with very traditional lines, some retro looking accessories as well. They all work because the colors, the textures, and the lines work together. I am obsessed with the tiny white pottery bowls, which only cost $3.99. Displayed against a black wall, it's a really, really striking look. It's natural to find cleaning products in the butler's pantry, so I was really excited to find this gorgeous old wood broom with natural bristles. I think it's $12.99 in store, so it's a great deal as well. We had a lot of gorgeous containers in here, old wooden crates and this beautiful white wire basket that you can see right through, and we used it to display some tea towels. I think we can put the cutting board right here. As far as butler's pantry go, this is pretty elegant. This particular look is right up my alley. This is my dream, dream pantry. The second that I came up with was a kind of farmhouse breakfast nook. The color palette for this look was so soft and so delicate and beautiful, and I felt that we could also bring in some heavier pieces to create an interesting uh, balance. And so we found some beautiful chairs, a mix of a, a light linen banquette and a set of chairs also covered in this beautiful blue linen. The settee was such a great piece, so sophisticated, and the price was just irresistible. I love this for our space because our space is reading very traditional to me and I want to bring something that just has a bit more texture. I think this is perfect. I found this gorgeous oversized piece of art, but all the tones in there totally fit our space. When you have something as beautiful as a set of copper pots and pans, why hide it behind closed doors? Find a way of displaying it beautifully. In this case, we're using it in our breakfast nook and I think it works totally seamlessly. It's just about letting the shape and the color of the piece speak for itself. Yeah, that's beautiful. When I'm styling a space, I love to bring in some natural elements. In this breakfast nook, I have really wanted to bring in some fresh herbs to make it feel like Provence, and we got fresh rosemary and thyme. This idea came to me when we found these amazing wire baskets from HomeSense to fill them with some farm fresh brown eggs because as luck would have it, they come in all the tones that you find in copper pots and pans, so it was a natural fit. We 
brought this beautiful lantern as the light fixture, which is kind of unexpected for the indoors, but I think it really just made the space. And this one was only $40. The light, it's really romantic, it's inviting, and it's not too formal. I think we achieved something that's really just casual, but very sophisticated. We created two looks that could not be more different, but I'm equally thrilled with both of them. One is really industrial and modern, has very high contrast. The other is warm and romantic and soft um, and quite rustic. But they both display copper pots and they do it, I think, quite well. Copper is a material that is incredibly versatile and because it's a reflective metal also, you get this beautiful brightness and shine from it. So it's something that's worth taking out of the cupboard, dusting off and really showcasing in a space. And you don't need just one, you can have a lot of it. Really embrace it, go for it, take some chances and have fun decorating with it.